So I just took my nighttime medication and uh, I'm gonna be lo loopy, loony, loopy, loony. I'm gonna be going crazy in a little bit here. Uh, let's get it out of my system. I've already got it going through my head right now that like, goddamn it, any program. Which I was told that I might have a virus that's resetting the program. So in other words, I have to uninstall and reinstall the program every time it fucks up. <sighs> Not that this is any of your business, of course. But anyways, um, yeah, this this is going to be coming out a couple of days later than when I'm actually recording it. So just be aware. I recorded it. Just technical difficulties. Yeah, uh, today is, well, now it's, uh, what is today? Tuesday? Yeah, Tuesday, February 16th, 2016. And, uh, actually a couple of days ago, uh, we got pictures of the 6th Ranger from Dobutsu Sentai Jojer, which actually debuted two days ago, three days ago, something like that. Uh, and I didn't watch it. I haven't even watched it subbed. Um,. To be fair, the theme, not bad. Not bad. What do animals and cubes have to do with each other? I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I might give the henching device. I've kind of slightly, maybe, changed my mind. I might give the, 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 the dual cube device thing, like, I'm kind of changing my mind. Like, it's no bigger than this. To a side. But that being said, which means it's basically no bigger than my fist. So, I might. I might go for it. But anyways, um, uh, new picture surfaced of the 6th Ranger. What's he called? Juo the World. Beast King the World? I don't know. Uh, debuted on, uh, let's see, it would have been February 9th, which was seven days ago. Well, now it's seven days ago. Um, he's got this, he, he kind of has this feeling of like a Gokaiger vest, but then it's it's split. Uh, and then there's a more detailed picture, and I like the way his helmet goes in three different ways. Like, there's one that it starts like this and then it folds up, which is cool. And then there's a third one, which is like this and then folds up. Or, no, I'm sorry, it starts up here and then it folds down. So, so it's actually two different, two different sections. There's one, there's two of them where, where one is like this and then it goes up like this. And then there's the other one where it goes down like this and then back up. So there's, I'm sure there's some interplay happening in there, which is cool. I mean, how on earth do you get one? I mean, getting one ranger to represent two different animals is difficult enough as it is. But now you've got one ranger representing three animals. That's pretty cool. I, I, I kind of like that. i got to respect them. That that works for me. That works. Um, in terms of the animals that are selected, alligator, rhino, wolf, we've seen all three of these a couple of times. Uh, we've even seen the alligator and the wolf paired together. So throwing Rhino in, well, we'll see what happens. So, uh, Jewel of the World, he's not a character from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, is what uh, J.E. Fusion claims. Cute. I need to see uh, JoJo's Bizarre Adventures Adventure someday. Hmm. But anyways, um, was it today? Let's see, 16... 16 yeah, today uh, we got some new mecha. Yay. Uh, not sure if yay. Uh, the first thing I noticed is Cube Mole, which is an exclamation point. Turns out there was an ex... Wait a minute. The giraffe... Cube Giraffe is an exclamation point, so why, are they, why do they have two of them now? Not sure. Anyways, uh, this is our second Super Sentai Mole, I think. Yeah. This is our second one. It's you know, it's a very one-sided critter, you know. The other side's probably just half the exclamation, 
two exclamation points for the same mecha. That's slightly strange. Why did I close those? That's slightly dumb of me. And then we've got the bear, which is another exclamation point. Um, that's very, very flat. Very. Sure. Um, that the that, that bear is only that big. The 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 bear isn't even one of the main mech. It's one of the accessories, and it's that tiny. Don't say I'm not disappointed. And the alligator is oh, well, it's better. Uh, it's better than the freaking elephant. Where, you know, as Prime 92 and Maxilla pointed out, basically looks like its ass exploded. We're just for cyber. I mean, I like the way they, they did the, the head coming out of the, key, uh, out of the corner. That was a good idea. But the rest of it was just kind of a disaster. So. I guess. I guess, like, the alligator's head kind of, kind of splits in half. So, you know, like half, the, the top half of the head goes this way, bottom half of the head goes this way. I could get behind that. I suppose. <clears throat> Boy, that, that bear is really disappointing. And then we've got, no, the wolf. Okay. Oh, oh, correction. Uh, cube Mogura, which is the mole. Cube Kuma, which is the bear. The weapon modes are yet to be revealed. Next are Cube Crocodile and Cube Wolf. Two of the components that will soon join Cube Grano and become Zuo, Zuo, the world's personal mecha, Tosai Juo. Whatever Tosai Juo means. <sighs> that wolf is pretty bad. That wolf is pretty bad. You know, if, if they're struggling so hard to get the thing to open up to look like a, cu a cube and then look like an animal, why even bother with the cubes? Bandai Plex Toei, why, why are you bothering with cubes? Do do like a sphere or a or a or a pyramid or a a diamond or you know do something like that cubes. I'm not seeing it right now. Um. Okay, so there was those, which was the animals, which so far and, and to be fair though, they they are coming up with some different colors. I'm pretty sure I've never seen that pale tan for a Super Sentai Mecha before on the crocodile, and he's like. Can't do it right. Okay, and then the next one was Jewel, the world's transformation device revealed. Shaped like a flashlight with a rhino's head on the front, Jewel, the world, I'm sorry, Jewel, the light will be Jewel, the world's main transformation device. The cube is centered between the main lamp and the handle, and this can be rotated just like the animals. When activated in the rhino symbol, the special effects will be Uo Uo Rhinos. No def additional information has yet has been added yet, so that means we will have to wait for the second official second quarter toy catalogs. And keep in mind, none of these are official. These are all scans. None of these are official. Uh, so his light is a f or so his ancient device is a flashlight. Can't really see that being a rhino. At least it's not a cell phone. And in terms of flashlights, well, the Excellular from Bokinger had a black light LED, which was part of its gimmick. So, but that that wasn't really a flashlight. Flashlights in Super Sentai, have they ever done that? I don't think so. Uh, I, I don't think they have. So, it looks, it, it, it doesn't look even remotely like a flashlight, but at least it's not a cube phone. This is not a flip-top cell phone thing again. Maybe it's just that I'm too, it's too late for me to be doing this. But... Mm. 
anything else? Let's see. Anything else? Check the home page of JE Fusion. No, I think that's it. <clears throat> Drew King's first battle. I'm going to have to watch that. Just to see how flippin' ridiculous it is. And then, oddly, the elephant and the tiger are there, even though they're not used in the combination. What? For a moment there, I forgot I was recording. So, alright. They're struggling to make animals out of these cubes. Why did you even bother with cubes? Why didn't you do spheres? Like, don't get me wrong, rock lords and egg planet people thingies, whatever you want to call them. Cubes? I don't, I don't get it. It's like they're trying so hard to make them look different and interesting, they kind of forgot, oh yeah, we kind of put this restriction on ourselves by making them cubes. I wonder what the point is of uh, uh, the the mole and what was the other one? The bear. Bear. The bear is one of the accessory mecha, but it's this really tiny. I mean, really tiny. Like bears are usually a big animal. Why are you making it a small one? Make the wolf a small animal. That makes sense. And it's one sixteen a.m. I'm going to go to bed. It hasn't changed my mind about it. Like I still like Jewel Wild. That's st that's still great. I'm still going to try and get that. Jewel King, if I have to, I will only get Jewel King because it might be part of a good combination later on. So that that that's that is yet to be determined whether I pursue that or not. Monoleg Stupid. Not quite sure if I'm going to tack this on to the video where the same... How do I say this? I re a number of days ago, I recorded some new footage regarding my impressions of the, the new Juodra stuff. So there was a mole, there was a wolf, there was a bear, there was an alligator. There was four of them, right? Yeah. Um... Needless, needless to say, I didn't, I didn't like it very much. Uh, but the video was only 13 minutes. I'm actually looking at the number right there. It was 13 minutes and change. I might cut it down by a few seconds, but whatever. Um, so JE Fusion, and now today is, let's see, it'd be February 20th, 2016. Um, and JE Fusion has released pictures of the first combination. Um, because it's just the combination, and I'm hoping some clarified pictures. Um, I, don't know, I, I might tack this on to my initial reaction to, uh, was it Juo the Wild, his stuff that I recorded a couple days ago, or I might just make this its own video. Kind of to tell. Turn this down a little more. Let's see, how's that? Okay, that's all better. Like that. Okay, here we go. So again, J Fusion. Do, 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 do. Cross my eyes intentionally so I can't see it. Wild Juo King revealed. Whoa. Um. Whoa. Okay. Um. Hmm. You remember that thing? Um. That. Which one was it? Um, Tokyo, Tokyo. Um, the the it was like what was it? The Cho Cho Tokyo, something like that. It was the super version, whatever it is. Had a mecha on either side of the feet, and then there were just extra mecha plugged into the sides for the arms. This kind of does that. Um. Oh, by the way, we found out, okay, so this explains what the, the canon for the, uh, 
the ape, or that it was a jewel or cube, cube gorilla, I think it was. So it turns out that's not the head for jewel wild. That's actually the chest and the. Oh, okay. So that's that's the chest of this thing, and then the Gatling gun forms the horns. All right. Okay. Um. The wow. By the way, them uh, them arms. Them, them lower arms. I, I, I don't. Well, there's the giraffe, which, damn. I was kind of hoping it'd be, you know, be like a dual wielding megazord or something like that, where it would have dual cannons, da, 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 da. kind of oversized pistols or something like that. I don't know. And then the bear is the axe, which it's 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 not a gun and it's not a sword. It's an axe. I can oh, and it's not a mace and it's not a it's not a staff. You know, may, maybe it is. You know, I I just had this thought maybe the the bear, which by the way totally doesn't look like a bear when it's all maybe the bear the giraffe and the mole maybe each of them can be weapons for what is this called uh wild juo king wild juo king wild juo king all right maybe maybe they are like maybe the bear forms an axe the giraffe forms a gun, and the well, or a rifle or whatever, and then the mole forms a drill gun or something like that. Like maybe it can swap back and forth. Considering it looks like all three of them transform exactly the same way, it's not without reason that you could you could actually say that yeah, they actually. If it's true, like maybe the axe fits on the back of the arms or something like that. Oh, I see. That's that's. Okay, so that's Cube Gorilla's chest, or I'm sorry, that's Jewel Wild's chest on the back of the right shoulder, so. Huh. Well, Monolig is expected for combinations. It's not unheard of. Um, that doesn't mean I have to like it, but, ah, and then, wait, mm -mm -mm. I feel like there's one that's missing. Oh, no, it's because, um, the tiger is actually in the chest. Okay, all right, tiger's in the chest. This... The, the the reviews for Jewel King are starting to flood out. The first episode actually aired last week, literally a week ago. Um, this, what did I call it? Wild Jewel King? Wild Jewel King, yeah, which is a terrible name, by the way. Wild Jewel King. Wild, because it, it, it's basically Wild Beast King King. Excuse me, I'm sorry. So it's it's so it, that's a very redundant name. It's Wild Beast King King is what it literally translates to. And then there's a little fan art down here which is yeah, okay. I still don't get why they couldn't get the lion the elephant I can understand why they couldn't get the elephant to separate into two separate legs that I understand like considering how the thing twists around especially on its exploded ass view I can understand that why that can't um, separate but why can't the lion separate why can't the shark separate you didn't have to have that huge bullet train thing going through whatever that thing is you didn't have to have that going through the center of the thing. I mean, it's not like anything on, on Cube Shark or Cube Lion even open up when you put the, the stylus train through. Train, stylus, stylus, train. 
it it doesn't happen. I mean, just put it through. And, yeah. The shoulders, or I mean, the forms are really wide. I think in this case, it's okay. I can give that a pass. The legs, though, hmm. is that what Super Sentai does nowadays? You you don't do the boots where they're kind of standing on these massive soles, kind of uh, Elton John style. You know, you they're not doing that anymore. They don't they don't give them like actual armor anymore, except the chest and maybe the head. Is is that where Super Sentai goes nowadays? Because I'll tell you, I've got the um, was it the Astro Galactic? No, I'm sorry, Astro Delta Megazord, which is the Galaxy Omega combined with the Delta Mega. Excuse me. And that thing is way better armed and armored than this thing is. And that that's a first line combo. Or that that's a that's a super combination, so Well I guess I shouldn't be surprised with block formers nowadays. Block formers and parts formers, which I guess I shouldn't complain too loudly. No, I should be complaining. It's just they're not going to listen to us on it. Okay. The Wild Jewel King. Wild Jewel King. That sounds so strange. I don't know why. I don't get it. I, I don't get it. Now we still haven't. Now, now, now that I think about it, um, let me backtrack. Is there more on Jewel Wild? Hopefully there is. Something tells me there isn't, though. No, there's nothing on Jewel Wild. So it's weird. They're showing off this first combination. Well, I suppose it makes sense to have this appear first, because I mean, this this isn't even mid-season yet. I kind of like the big, like, I don't like how wide the arms are, or at least how wide the lower arms are, upper arms. On the other hand, I like that it has these big bulky shoulders, especially in this fan art here. If you look at it from behind, it's still going to be, you know, uh, was it, f let's see, the, the tiger is five, and then two, and then three, and then four. So it's still going to do that. This, as I was starting to say a few minutes ago, this might, this whole combination here, like I'm already thinking Jewel Wild is definitely worth getting. Um, and I was, and I, and, and I said, you know, my initial reaction, I said, if whatever combination involving Jewel Wild and Jewel King, and maybe Jewel the Wilds, uh, combined mecha, you know, with the, 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 the wolf and the, uh, the rhino and, um, oh, I'm tired of this medication is doing things to me. If, uh, I, I said, you know, previously, if, if the combined form looked good enough, then yes, I would get Juo King. I might not like Juo King, but I would get it in order to make the combined form. This, this here justifies Juo King, justifies me getting Juo King. Um, and I like the fact that it's just using a massive axe. That, that, that does it for me. That's, that's good. And if it turns out that you can plug, uh, cube, giraffe, and cube, what was it, Mogura, Mogura, cube mole, in as alternative weapons, that would justify having the weapons just casually placed on the outside of the legs. That would work. If it can do, if it can do this. If it can, that's actually good. That's, I can live with that. Yeah. It's almost like the combined form is the justification for getting them individually, and I don't like that. Ah, oh, Codeine, why you do this to me now? Like, I just discovered this a few minutes ago, and then a few minutes before that. Okay, yeah, so. Alright. 
this might justify getting Joe King. Joe Wild, yes, I was planning on getting it. The elephant looks terrible. The tiger looks terrible, especially now that I've seen what they can do in the show, which, eh. But, um, so I was already planning on getting Joe Wild, but this, this works for me. I can, I can live with this. Okay. That's it. Uh, if we're seeing the combination this early, we're probably going to see Jewel of the Wilds. Um, see the Sixth Ranger mech is going to show up. Probably, like, may, might even show up tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Okay. I'm tired. I'm going to go to bed. So, this is Unit 4A saying thank you for tuning in.